Hello, how are you and what's your name? Hello, I'm doing great. Thank you for asking. My name is Amelia Johnson. Hello everyone, welcome back on the channel. Guys, I'm Ramke Singh, Unity game developer, YouTuber and blogger. So in this video, I'm going to discuss about Conway AI, Chat GPT. Basically, it used the, basically it used the Chat GPT. So I've covered most of things. Like first part, I shared with you that how you can install it. And there are so many versions are coming. So almost process is same. And also I have set, set up, I have done set up for VR as well as also I have done that how you can convert in the URP as well as how you can use the action like you can ask your character to dance for you or just bring something for you. So now in this video what we are going to cover, we are going to cover about how you can use the Conv AI SDK for your WebGL project. So let's start the today video. And if you're new on the channel, make sure to subscribe the channel if you want to support. So please like and comment and you can also join or you can just become the Patreon member on my Patreon. So let's start the today video. If we are talking about, so here you can see, so here you can see that I'm using this version Unity 2022.3.39F1. So it is not very older. It is uh, almost okay in 2024 or 2025. That will be not very different. So it's if you are going to create your project, so first question will be that in which in which pipeline you have to create your project. So if you are going to create a 3D built-in return pipeline, so it will be okay. You have to not do anything. But if you are do, going to create in universal 3D, that is the UR. So after the installing the SDK of WebGL means Conway AI WebGL SDK. So you have to install your peak converter and then it will convert this thing so for this if you are going to do this i will provide the package that will help us to convert in urp and you can also grab from the conway ai uh, there is a two way to install the sdk first one is that you are for android vr or uh, window so you can just directly install from the unity asset store but for the webgl you have to install separate uh, package from their website okay so if you are using universal 3d so you have to use the converter I will drop the link in the description from my Patreon page so you can just grab from there but you have to become the Patreon by free or it's depend on that you want to grab any sample or you want to just support me. So let's start with this one and why I always uh, why I'll always request people to use the universal because it is really lightweight so you can it can run on a uh, smaller device like mon mobile vr devices webgl so it's a great thing also so let's start with the built-in render pipeline gl and the project and here they have also the video and they have missed some stuff so that's thing i'm covering here but their tutorials also great and for if you launch if you want to launch or if you want to test out so you can uh, launch on the itch.io or you can launch on unity play both are support the web here we want to use this it be just downloaded from here so here you can see that we are getting the package here so just click the download here and current version is b200 okay so now it is getting downloaded and this project you did not get on the unity asset store basically they have released separate package for web okay so now it have been installed so what we have to do go on the asset right click and here is the import package custom package go in the downloads and here is the conway unity webgl so we have to install this one and if you are creating the package in urp so at that time you have to use conway urp converter and grab it from you have to create separate project you have to grab it from unity asset store package you have to install in separate project or i will just drop the link directly where you can directly download. i downloaded this it is my second time so just open this one whenever you want to install any package means nowadays in unity so if you are installing first time and it, it is asking to install an upgrade so first time you have to choose this one so that it install all the dependency here. So just click install and upgrade. And this is the great thing in unity. And uh, just uh, last day we heard the news that they have free the unity means we have to not pay any 
charges for unity if we are releasing any application so we have to not share revenue of our our is getting updated all necessary and just let's go on the conway ai webs conway ai website we need we will need one key from there so let me do so we need this key so just download just copy this link also and here it is asking for import so just import everything so you can remember that for window android you have to use unity asset store but uh, for this i think we have to grab from here okay great and if you have any confusion you are having issue to install anything so you can just message on the discord and then i can help you out that it have been installed what is saying input manager could not be found okay so here you can see we got almost everything and here is the demo here is the scene okay so we are having some issue so before moving forward uh, first thing let's set up the our copied so we are just install everything and first thing let us do that is the uh, worst part that we don't have the webgl okay so in some cases you, if you are don't have so what you have to do you have to just download this one also so basically maybe it is uh, if you have installed already so there will be no any issue this is my version 3.9 so basically we have to go here and here is 3.9 add modules and we have to add webgl build support for my case it is not if you have so it is great so let let it finish it so now you can see we have the webgl ignore okay great so let's see what's showing us here so you can see here we can able to see the webgl so just switch platform now we have switch and you can click here development build and conveying could not be found so for this let's go on here player setting you can give the name and then in other setting you have to choose the input so here you can see active input handling it is currently input old so we have to use new but you can do the both so it will apply both and it will restart your project again now we have done the both now you can see it is showing both and one more thing we have to do in resolution and presentation and here it is default so basically we have to go conway ai pw template you have to choose this one and you can just give the width and height so you can manage this thing and now everything is looking good so just close this window and it is ready player me stuff we don't need right now basically they use the cc character creator player but also they are now giving the support of ready player me character here you can see we have the conway ai setup so just and here we have copy our key so now you can see i have set up the key and here we have the conway AI demo webgl so if you are going to run it let me run and let me show you and let me tell you that if you are working with the urp so in this case you will get everything pink so at that time so basically we have to urp converter so that we can convert in normal material now you can see girls is coming in proper material so that thing you have to use for converting it and let me run that and show you that how it is working and here it is asking for tmp essential for this one 
okay so now everything have been imported and go in the console clear everything and play here okay so here is the scene and here is the game view so we are able to see you can use w key to go closer and here you can see it is saying t to talk so whenever you will press t you will see here lots of errors why it is errors because webgl does not support in unity editor so how you can check this so so for checking this you have to close this one and you have to go in file build setting and here is the build and run and here you have to create one folder that is the build select folder and let it run so basically most of people miss this thing that webgl stuff does not means for the uh, for the con ai webgl it does not work on the unity editor you have to run directly build and run then you can release on the each.io or you can just run on the unity play so now it is asking for allow so just do allow and everything so just do this thing first and then allow mic and just go to the closer t button hello how are you and what's your name hello i'm doing great thank you for asking my name is Amelia Johnson. How about you? Uh, my name is Ram Kis. I am from Nest and Mango YouTube channel and doing tutorial on your stuff for the WebGL. Nice to meet you, Ramus. It sounds like you're working on something interesting. If you want, you can practice a little more or you can head to the escape right now. Okay, thank you. It's anything. So basically, there are lots of characters here. Basically, you have to fill the database and on the basis of that, they'll, they will respond. So that's it and if you want to ask anything so just let me know in the comment box and thanks for watching have a good day see you in next video bye bye take care please don't forget to like subscribe and share support me on patreon you can just grab any sample from there that will also help me to run my youtube channel so thanks for watching have a good day see you in next video bye bye take care